Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Alpine Road to Glory career, uh, season 3, uh, and only 3 races remaining here then, as we head to Mexico, Autodromo Hermanos Rodriguez, oh yeah, I love saying that, uh, we are gonna go into the qualifying session now, then the race, 71 laps, it's a long long race, but a fun fun race with that, uh, we had a little bit of a regulation change, but we don't care, because this is, this is the last season, right, of the Alpine Road to Glory career, so uh, we don't need to go and save the engine part for next season, because this is the last one before we retire. We are in P4 then, in 80 points, then 65 points to Max Verstappen, who is at the moment winning with a lot of margin. However, he DNF'd in the Singapore race. I'm telling you, you gotta watch that one if you have not yet. Um, but we won, so if we can continue this winning streak, that would be absolutely amazing. Uh, but let's see if we, if we can. We have an engine that we changed last uh, time around. I reckon this engine we can use all the way towards the end of the season. Uh, that would be amazing. Uh, so that we don't have, have to take another penalty, right? But let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. All right. I reckon it's time to get started straight away with the qualifying session. Ladies and gentlemen, tell your cat, your dog, your future grandkids, your future grandma. Tell them all that we're getting started with the qualifying session. Here we go. Let's do this. Boom. Uh, Branko though, thank you so much for the follow and for anybody who has not yet hit that follow button, you better do so, I'm telling you, you are missing out and remember, it's my birthday, today, today in uh, 13 weeks, so if you have not yet uh, followed for my birthday, uh, do it, because uh, that would make my birthday amazing, okay, hey Tom, you've inspired me to go buy a G923 and play F1 2020, I love it, cheers mate, you're welcome mate, That's, that is awesome, makes my day, have fun man, love that, uh, Seppi HRSP, thank you so much for the follow as well. Welcome to the family. Who will win in Miami? I will win in Miami. I will. No, it's going to be very interesting because it's a new track. Anybody can win. It could even be uh, McLaren or something come, coming out of nowhere, RKOing everybody, right? Future grandma? Of course, of course, of course. All right, here we are then, ladies and gentlemen, in the qualifying session. It's time to get serious as we are gonna go and do 18 minutes of qualifying however we only have three sets of tires will we use all three sets of tires that's the question we can also actually use the medium tires uh, but the, but those are like 1.1 seconds slower do we want to risk it do we want to risk the strategy on uh, going onto the medium tires and perhaps not even make it into the top 10 we could try it or or we could save the medium tires for the race. I think that's going to be very uh, smart, actually. If we save the medium tires for the race. Let's see. Yeah, I will continue. I will continue F1 2021 uh, content, of course. Until F1 22 releases. But this will be the last Alpine Road to Glory season. So only three more races left now. Huh? And then after that, we'll have something else. You're asking me, what the hell are you doing then? I will not tell you. Ha! <laughs> you got you baited. You got you baited. You, you got, got, you got, got you baited. baited. You yeah, we did. Uh, what will you using? I'm using the Fanatec CSL Elite. If you put exclamation mark wheel in the chat, there will be a command uh, or there will be like a link and you can check it out. I even made a video about it, even though it was a, it's a two year old video. <laughs> this wheel is even, it's not even uh, for sale anymore, but uh, yeah, watch that video. It's very funny and cool, right? Because over here we are cool. Did you get the pre version though? No, I have not tried it yet. No, no, no. I have, I have not tried it yet. Yet. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and um, get ourselves onto the mediums or not. What do you think, guys? Should we... No, no, no. I don't think we should do mediums, right? 1.1 seconds. No way we're going to even be able to get into the top five or whatever, right? Mediums or softs, guys? Put it up in the chat. Put it up in the chat. What do you think? I think we should go softs. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, Caramelo do Bronx. Uh, thank you so much for the follow. What's up? Welcome to the family. And welcome to the show. Never say never. Exactly. One of the most famous archaeologists. Archaeologists in the world. Justin Bieber. Right? Remember him? He said that. He said it as well. Never say never. But I think we should go softs. <laughs> Softs, 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 softs. You guys are thinking so as well. Okay then, what we're gonna do then? We're gonna put five keys in the car. We're gonna go out on track. The question for the qualifying session in terms of the prediction will be, will we be able to get pull? No, let's say top three. 
Can we get the top three in this qualifying session? Yes or no? If one of the moderators could put in a prediction, can we get into the top three? Yes or no? That would be absolutely amazing. Justin Bieber is the greatest scientist of all time. Yeah, remember. Remember, remember, remember. Oh, yeah. What are you talking about, guys? DJ Khaled said, yeah, it was Justin Bieber. I remember that very well. All right, let's go out onto the track. And uh, let's go and put a banging lap, like banging. All right. Park for me. Okay, that means we cannot change the car whatsoever. Once we go out on track, then we are left up to our own. Actually, you know what? I want to check one thing. <laughs> Because if this is up... Okay, cool, 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 cool. We're, we're Gucci, we're Gucci. All right, here we go then. Standing by. Let's do it. Now, for anybody who um, does not know, by the way, I am currently in my last and final year at my studies. Um, and for that, I'm doing a research to, uh, to finish my studies, right? Now, I need your help. If you're between 12 and 22 years old, only then... Only if you're between 12 and 22 years old, please don't lie about your age because that will not help me whatsoever. Um, then if you could fill in my survey that I'm doing for my research, my final thesis, and then after that, hopefully I can go full time uh, with the content, uh, that would be amazing. So if you're between 12 and 22 years old and you watch Sim Racing content, which of course right now you're watching, <laughs> you're watching Sim Racing content, uh, then it would be amazing if you could fill in my server, uh, survey uh, and help me up. What if I'm 12 plus 22? Uh, then I will not need you today. Then I do not need you today. But I appreciate you uh, considering regardless, right? All right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, the link is in the chat for anybody who wants to help me out. Um, I need like 60, 60 more uh, answers. We got like 320 already. So that's pretty cool. Within two days. Uh, Boa Mooman, thank you so much for the follow. What's up? Welcome to the family. All right. Oh man, we were using a little bit of the hot lap mode as well already, guys. Which position do you think in the meantime we will get right here? I'm not quite sure if there is a prediction in the chat already, but uh, if not, I'll put it in after this lap right here. But let me know in the chat which prediction do you, or which uh, position do you think we are going to get in this uh, in this qualifying session? Here we go then, as we start with the hold lap mode enabled, we will have one lap and one lap only here in terms of the fuel that we have available in the car, or maybe even two, but uh, we're only going to do one lap because we don't want to ruin the tires before we've started uh, the, the race even, right? P11, P5, P2, okay then. As you break for the first turn into third gear, over the curbs up the inside, then over here as well, over the curbs hard, and into fourth gear, use all the track that we can, and then open up the DRS and uh, open up the flap, flap, flap to get a little bit of extra Suck. onto uh, the straight. In the third gear, as we are fastest purple in the first sector, can we keep this up? That is the question. No looking up, come on. And we have to keep the car out on track because we saw that in the next section right over here, we had some troubles keeping the car out on track. And that's very crucial because <laughs> we need to set a lap time here. At least we need to put a banker and then after that we can go all out. Full blazing. But we're purple, more rada. Fuxia, in whichever language you want to say purple. In the fifth gear. And then back to second. Come on, we got this. Come on, come on. Let's do this. Third gear, fourth gear. Through the last turn. And very close to the inside. So now we get the shortest run to the exit. It's going to be a P1 with a 112.6. Hey, yo. W. That's, that's one hell of a lap. One hell of a lap. Driver behind, driver behind. behind that was clean. <gasps> One tenth though ahead of Max Verstappen, and we're fighting for that P1, and we're super trooper close. Science though comes in between still of Max Verstappen and us. Driver behind. That last lap was a one minute no, no. Driver behind. Science is behind you. How much? <gasps> Twelve point six. 12.6 oh my goodness all right let's head back into the pits i'll put the prediction up in a little bit guys no worries i'll put the prediction up in a little bit no worries whatsoever what are the standings i will tell you in a little bit as we go back to the um to the team headquarters before we head into the race i'll show the standings one more time 
but at the moment we are, uh, I believe we have 80 points with Verstappen 145. So there is a little bit of pressure on us. If we want to try and battle for the championship, we have to make everything count. Basically, we have to win all three races. Right? That was good, though. A good first lap. Now, for anybody who's wondering, by the way, today will be the last stream of the week. Um, then the next stream will probably be Wednesday, because on the Thursday I'm going to Miami, and uh, I will be coming back from Portugal on Tuesday, because I'm going tomorrow. So, uh, yeah. Gonna be busy, huh? Gonna be busy. But, uh, yeah, I'll make sure to try and uh, squeeze in that, that, that uh, which, I don't know which race is gonna be. The second to last race of the season, I believe that is going to be... Not Saudi Arabia, but the one before. Brazil! Brazil, indeed. Finish your survey, hope it helps. Thank you so much, Mulit. I appreciate you. Thank you very much. That's much appreciated. It's gonna help me loads. It really does. Filled in the survey as well? Hell yeah, epic. Thank you. Appreciate that, guys. All right. What up, Trifos the first? Welcome to the show as well. All right, so at the moment, B1. <gasps> oh my god! What the hell? 0 0.001. Ladies and gentlemen, these are the gaps between Carlos Sainz and us. One thousand of a second. Can you believe it? Can you flip and believe it? That is what we do over here. Oh my goodness. Uh, for those of you who are just joining in, you're joining into the qualifying session. The action has started around Autodromo Hermanos Rodriguez, right? In uh, Mexico. Uh, it's great to have you here. My name is Tom and they call me the bomb, okay? They call me the bomb. Guys, number one in the chat. If everybody always comes into the chat and they say, Tom, you are the bomb, man. Oh my God, you're so sexy. Can I uh, lick your toe? What? No, 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 no. Right? But they do say I'm the bomb and I'm sexy, right? They do. Okay, the prediction is... Oh, wait, I'm, I'm putting a poll. No, I'm doing a prediction. There you go. Prediction. Uh, will we qualify? Will we get poll? I'm not going to even... <laughs> will we get poll? Yes. No. You have about one minute to predict, okay? So get predicting right now, literally one minuto. Uh, Storm XX8 as well as Epic SXMZ. Thank you so much for the follows. If you haven't yet followed, by the way, make sure you do so. Thank you. I appreciate that. High five for you. Can I lick your toe? No, 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 no. Get out of here. How did the Alpine stream go yesterday? It went very, very well. Uh, for those of you who have missed it, uh, the 12th of May, second, second round of the Alpine Esports uh, series. I'll be commentating, so if you've ever wanted to see me commentate a real race, right? Or, well, it's, it's a sim racing race, but still, like a real race, like a professional race, like me being like very professional, then uh, check it out. Uh, exclamation mark Alpine in the chat, and you'll be able to follow the Alpine Twitch channel. There'll be a link, um, because for anybody who doesn't know, I'm an ambassador of the Alpine Esports team, and uh, with that, I'll be doing super, super cool stuff with, uh, with Alpine Esports in the future. Um, so looking forward. Yo! Welcome to the family. What's good, you absolute legend? How you doing? Wake up, wake up, wake up. Revan coming in with a two month resub with Twitch Prime as well. Thank you so much, uh, Revan man. And uh, welcome in to the subscription family once more. Flipping primers, huh? It's prime time. Revan coming in with a Twitch Prime. Thank you so much. Uh, and I appreciate you, uh, you spending that prime on me. Much, much appreciated. Uh, Ferenc, by the way, as well as Aksu and Slim Elephant. Thank you for the follows, too. High five for you. Thank you so much. Welcome to the family. You got into the suck is very professional. Guys, I'm, I'm going to say it, okay? All right. So you better watch round two or round three. I will say he's going into the suck, okay? A hundred percent. I'm promising you now. I will say on the official broadcast, he's going to get into the suck. It's going to happen. It has to happen, okay? All right. It's time for us to do one more lap, because we've done one lap, but remember, one thousandth of a second are separating Carlos Sainz and us at the moment. They're gonna do another lap, and they're gonna be quicker. I'm 100% sure of that, so we need to be quicker as well. Uh, because if we stay over here, it could mean that we drop down a little bit. However, 
I mean, a P3 would be great as well, right? But we want to go for a pole position. Now, the question is, will we do it? What do you think? Number one in the chat, if you think, Tom, this pole position is yours. Number two, if you think, uh, Tom, you're not so bomb. Uh, you're not going to get the pole position. Uh, X, Y, X, Z. Thank you for the follow. What's up? Welcome in. I hope you're doing good today. Make yourself at home. All right, guys, what we're going to do? A little bit less fuel on the car, five kilos. And then we will go and accelerate the time to about two and a half minutes. So that we can go out onto the track for one last final run. We see a couple of improvements. Oh my god, we need to go now. We need to go now. Yo! Welcome to the family. What's good, you absolute legend? How you doing? Wega, 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 man. Positive vibes. 23 gifted a tier one sub to Waldo underscore. Hell yeah. Positive vibes coming in with the gifted the sub then to Waldo. Um, and Ford, Ford gifted sub in total as well. Get those yo's in the chat. You know what to do. Silver yo's if you're a follower. Gold yo's if you're a subscriber. If somebody subscribes or gifts or whatever, we spam those yo's in the chat to uh, thank them for their generosity, right? Uh, there you go. Where are you from, Tom? I am from the uh, Netherlands myself. Uh, epic. Let me know where you're from. Actually, let me know where in the chat where everybody is from at the moment. Uh, every time I ask, literally, I see, I see new, I see new countries every single time. We have the most diverse Twitch chat in the entirety of uh, the world. It's crazy. Put it up in the chat. Where are you watching from at this point in time? Look at that: Portugal, Slovakia, Germany, Turkey, Belgium, um, Italy, uh, Pakistan. I see uh, Bulgaria. Estonia, Norway, uh, Ireland, USA, Sweden, Czech, Kenya, USA, Czech, South Africa, Norway, Michigan, all over the world. Look at that. Finland, everywhere. Dubai, Poland. Crazy, huh? And we're all coming together as one big family just to have fun. Exactly. That is our main purpose, and that is what we're going to have. So, let's go through the last and final turn to set up ourselves for one of the best laps we've done in our entire li life. We go all the way around the outside here of the track so that we can go and carry more speed onto the straight. Boom! Let's do it. What? Why are we losing time? Oh, the DRS! I'm stupid! No! Oh my god! I'm actually stupid. No. I did not open the DRS. Come on, come on. We can still we can still gain time here. We can still gain time. In the fifth gear, the sixth. Oh my god. Three tenths, two and a half. Come on, come on. We can still do this. We can still do this. No! It is going to be Verstappen who grabs pole position just about by a tenth. Come on. Can we gain just a tiny bit of time here? Way too deep. Way too wide as we drift through the last and final turn. That is not going to be an improvement for us. And it will be B2. Just about then, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be coming home in P2 and we lose out on pole position. But by how big of a margin? How, how big of a margin then? How big of a margin? We're all ready for tomorrow's no. race, but before we begin, oh my goodness. We, however, stay in front Verstappen, of Carlos Sainz. 1,000th of a second with Verstappen. One and a half tens in front of us. Look at that. Look at that. Amazing. Uh, where are you from? I am from the Netherlands. Uh, Waxorian. I play on PC. It's PC. I used to play on PS4 though back in the day. But uh, that was two years ago. Uh, the Blues FP10. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family. Now, what we're going to do, we're going to go and advance the time. We're going to go back into the team headquarters and we're going to get started with the show of today. Because remember, over here, you don't watch a stream, you watch a show. So get your popcorn, get your crisps, get everything you need uh, and enjoy. Because I'm going to make sure that uh, these 71 laps that are coming up right here are going to be the most enjoyable laps you've ever had in a, in a race so far, okay? All right.
the most amazing laps you've ever seen in your entire life. So, ladies and gentlemen, right, we're back in the team headquarters. Now, exactly. I I agree. I feel that it was a success. Okay, I can't talk. <laughs> a successful qualifying, Jeff. Yeah, I agree. Because uh, from P2, we'll be able to do anything we want. We just need to get a good start, get into the suck, into the suck. Oversteppen, and from there, boom, shakalaka. We can win the race, right? So let's see what we can do. We have an engine that should be able to make it all the way to throughout the race. So that's good. Uh, do we have any particular issues here with any of the engine parts? No. So this one is only 14%. So that's very, very good. We have plenty of laps remaining on this engine. So let's hope that it can stay that way. And we can go all out for, uh, for the race. Now, let's get started then with the race. 71 laps of pure racing goodness. Getting started right here right now now for those of you by the way who have not yet subscribed to my main youtube channel do it uh, I'll, i've put the link in the chat uh, i just uploaded a new video of me going to paris talking with esteban ocon and commentating over his racing live meeting him saying yo esteban how are you doing he said oh my god tom you're sexy i know but uh, in that video everything you can see of my trip to paris for the alpine car launch and a special go, event with esteban ocon um, i'm sure a you'll love it we are gonna get started though for the formula one grand prix de las, de las ciudad de mexico um four the uh, the third to last race of the season it's going to be getting very very interesting over here a super long straight so getting the drs or staying in the drs is super important so i think we should uh, adapt our strategy uh, on that as well onto that 4.3 kilometer long track with three drs zones and like i said a lot of um, slip sheen opportunities right so it's gonna be Circuit, tough to overtake when you're in the train but if you're the out of the train then you're gonna start losing a lot a lot of time what today is mexico grand prix uh, what 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 was that uh, what was that fact i could not even read that before we begin <laughs> <laughs> it did not make sense what the starting grid then is going to be looking like the following we're stepping in p1 by one and a half tenths he was just a little bit superior here uh, but we did make a mistake on the last and final lap us in p2 with signs 1000 of a second behind of us with leclerc in p4 and gasly in p5 with hamilton in p6 then we have ricardo p7 and our teammate uh, coming home in p8 with Bottas a little bit further down the grid but it does seem like he had a penalty because he doesn't really belong there now further down the grid we have a couple of other drivers including uh, the Haas drivers who didn't really have the best of cars and of course the man the mid the legend the Mazapan in P20 wow this is gonna be a good race I can feel it in my water I can feel it in my water guys all right now remember you guys are part of the engineering team you guys get to decide what we do so get yourselves involved right now and um and get yourselves involved in the chat right so we're gonna we're gonna choose it together we're gonna pick it together what 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 is this what is this strategy huh three times softs one times mediums i reckon we should try and avoid as many stops as we can and we should try and do less pit stops we have a little bit of overcast at the start so the soft tires will be a little bit better because it's not that hot however Perhaps we'll be overheating the tires and then we'll be needed to go onto the medium tires later on, right? So what I think we should do, perhaps we should go and uh, take out one of the pit stops right there. And perhaps even do soft, medium, medium, or maybe soft, medium, soft. We can do this even. Or we can do soft, medium, medium. No, that's going to be a lot slower, huh? Yeah, soft, medium, soft looks like the best one. Can we even take this one away? No. So this one looks like the best one, perhaps. Starting on the softs, then going onto the mediums and then going onto the softs. Or, look, the thing is, guys... The thing is, normally we like to be very quick at the end, right? But the standard strategy for most drivers is this one. Soft, 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 medium or soft, soft, medium, most likely. Now, the thing is, I was talking about uh, the DRS being very, very important. So we need to stay within one second of the car in front. And being on the mediums compared to their softs, it's going to be super hard for us to stay in, in behind of them, right? So what I think we should do is I think we should go and, um, and get into a... It's very similar strategy as them and i think we should do soft soft medium even though it's not the quickest strategy uh, i think this is going to be the best because in staying behind of them that's going to be making the difference for us and if we can stay in the drs or at least stay stay close to them or stay in front of them right then we'll then we'll be in the fight and if we lose um the drs on them then we'll be out of the fight and we have to work really hard at the end 
on those soft tires to actually get back into it. But I'm going to ask you guys. I'm going to do a poll. So two options, really. And uh, we can still go and change the, the strategy from there. Because remember, everything can change in the race. And then from there... Um, we can we can change we can adapt the strategy as well, right? So let me go and put a poll in the chat, and then you guys can go and uh, vote on it. What is the strategy? What is the strategy? Is it uh, soft, medium, soft, or is it soft, soft, medium? I personally think soft, soft, medium is the one because then we can stay in the DRS. But it's up to you. It's up to you. You guys are the engineers. You guys get to decide. Get voting. Boom shagalaga. Here we go. Uh, Jeppa, thank you so much for the follow. Baby Sirk, as well as Clipper and Aimer. I appreciate that. If you haven't yet hit that follow, by the way, my birthday is literally today uh, in 12 weeks. So if you haven't yet followed, do it for my birthday and get voting in the poll that is up in the chat right now. 40 seconds to vote. And then whichever one gets the most amount of votes, we will go for. So let's see. Where is soft, medium, medium? I mean, if, this, if the softs are overheating, we can always go mediums, but... It was 11 seconds slower, so I reckon the softs are going to be better, right? So get voting! What do you think? 36 votes on soft, soft, medium. 35 on soft, medium, soft. Oh my goodness. I hope it's soft, soft, medium. Because we have done this race in the past. And normally, if we go for the strategy that's quick at the end, we lose the DRS and we can't make back make up the time, you know? So uh, let's see. Let's see. Uh, it's a tomocracy, right? But... At the moment, it's very even. Very, very even. 45 on soft, soft, medium. And 45 on soft, medium, soft. Oh my god, don't tie this. If it ties, guys, I choose. <laughs> if it ties, I choose. 50 votes for soft, soft, medium. With 47 for soft, medium, soft. And it's done. And that means we are going to do the strategy that we have available. Or that we have selected right now. But that's, that was very close. So it's a very, it's a very divided poll. Right? Very divided. So let's see which one was the correct one. Um, we normally try the soft, medium, soft strategy, but I reckon this time around, we're gonna be okay to do this, huh? We're gonna be okay to do this. What is the difference between soft and medium? All right, very short, very easy. Softs are softer tire. Well, there you go. Softer tire. They, um, they wear more easily, but they're quicker. They're 1.1 seconds quicker per lap, but the tires will be done a lot quicker. Mediums are harder tires, and uh, they're slower, but they, they endure a lot more laps. So uh, it's about finding the right balance. And uh, getting the best strategy, right? Uh, Reweed, as well as Red Telly Tubby, as well as Dubai. Hell yeah. As well as uh, Yes Sir Neo. Thank you so much for the follow. The prediction is for the win, right? Yeah, let's do it for the win. Let's go for a prediction. Will we win the race? All right, guys. We're ready to go then. We selected everything we need to select. And we're ready to go for the start of the Mexican Grand Prix. Remember though, over here, we don't do a stream. We do a show. So, what we always like to do is we like to get ourselves into the mood. And that's exactly what I'm going to do right now. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Beninging. The Beninging of the Mexican Grand Prix. The beginning of the end. It is time that we are going to hit back hard because Verstappen has 125 points. We have 80. That means we need, we need to go and get points. A lot of points. And he needs to DNF. Now, of course, we don't have everything within our hands, but what we do have in our hands is that we can push all out and that we can win this race now let me know in the chat right now where is everybody watching from put it up in the chat and let's see all the nationalities coming together as one big family where are you watching from put it up in the chat and let's see all the nationalities coming together as one big team i see a switzerland i see a czech republic london spain norway netherlands mars i see a sweden turkey scotland uh, manchester uh, tibet germany swiss netherlands turkey germany saudi arabia slovakia milky way australia uh, germany italy australia uh, greece uh, france spain tunisia czech republic deutschland ireland all the world but it does not matter where you're from it does not matter what you look like what matters is that you are here right now whether you're from colombia usa dominican republic ladies and gentlemen welcome welcome to the fun 
Welcome to the best show on Twitch. Let's have some fun. Let's go. Let's do this. All right, let's go. Guys, let me drink one last sip of my water because I will not have water for the next 71 laps. Right? All right, cool. Boom. Jack Wills as well as Skench OP and Code Dylan. Thank you so much for the follows. If you haven't yet, go on and hit that follow button. You better do so. Exclamation mark reply. There you go. I replied. All right, let's go. Let's get started then. Um, did we select everything? Yes, boom. The lights are going to go on for the formation lap. The prediction will be, will we win this race? Yes or no? So if one of the moderators could put that prediction in the chat for about five minutes or something like that. Something like that we always do, right? Uh, will we win the race? Yes or no? That would be amazing. Champion! Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family. And remember, if you want to watch back any of the episodes of the, um, of the season. Oh my god. Okay, we have to redo the formation lap. <laughs> My mom brought me something, but <laughs> wait, 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 wait! Okay, okay. I was ex I was distracted. I was distracted. Come, on, come on, man! <laughs> I, I was distracted, man. Come on! My mom brought me something. <laughs> Again, nobody saw anything, guys. Smile in the chat. Just put smileys. Just put smileys. Just put smileys. Nobody saw anything. All right. If somebody joins right now, just they, they're just gonna see smileys. Okay. All right. Serpent, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family. What's up? As we go behind over Stefan, uh, we are gonna get started with the formation lap. Uh, the prediction is up in the chat as well. Will we win this race? Yes or no? That is the question. We're gonna try and do our very very best to uh, overtake Verstappen and hope to not have as uh, as hard of the t tires to handle. Right? Because. Normally, or in the past, we've seen that our tires are... Uh, they It can go to a very, very high temperature, and then we're struggling a little bit. So let's hope the tire temperature is going to be okay. And that we can handle it all the way throughout. Now, the question is, guys. Which position exactly do you think we are going to end in? Is it going to be P1? Is it going to be P2? Is it going to be P20? I don't know. It's up to you. What do you think? Pink Mercedes gang? No, no, no. This is the Alpine. Because we're, uh, you've joined in to the Alpine Road to Glory. This is uh, round 8 out of 10 in season 3. The last and final season. And for that, we are using the, the pink livery as a celebratory livery for the last and final season, right? The, the same one that you've seen in uh, at the start of the season. Now, if for those of you who are wondering, oh my god, Tom, you're using the 2022 liveries? Yes, man! Uh, if you want to use them too, you can do so. Uh, the link is in the chat right there. You can uh, click the link, join the Discord, and in there, I have a link to the download, so you can uh, use it for yourself as well if you want to. All the 2022 liveries. Cool, right? All right. All right, all right, all right. Ryan MCN, thank you for the follow too as we jump up onto the grid with just Milo coming in with the follow too. High five for you, no boom! Thank you so much. Being, no threat of rain, good. which uh, was to be, was to be suspected, right? But I'm uh, very happy that they that they finally confirmed it because uh, <laughs> you never know with Jeff, huh? You never know. Now let's go onto the grid then and let's go and rev the engine all out. Uh, come on, come on, come on. As the lights go on in just a little bit, we'll get started with 71 laps of uh, uninterrupted racing goodness. Here we go then, as the lights go on for the start of the Mexican Grand Prix. Can we get a good start compared to Verstappen? When they go off, we have to go off straight away as well, and we do. And Verstappen gets an atrocious start, an atrocious start. Now, can we actually go for the overtake? No, it's signs from P3 with a rocket start. And he immediately gains the position as we close in, close in, but we lose the position to the car of Gasly. Now then, we try and break up the inside, but Verstappen doesn't leave us a lot of space. And now Verstappen is going to try and go all the way around instead of signs then with them touching on the inside. It's going to be very, very tough here for us to really overtake. But if we get into the old board then perhaps we can do something. Not really. I don't really want to go up the inside either. But Verstappen is battling super, super hard to gain uh, or regain that P1 position. And I think he's going to do so right now. However, we're going to try and make it three wide. We're going to try and make it three wide with, oh my goodness, look at all the tires. Verstappen back in P1. And we are up at the P2 then as we regain P3 and P4, which we lost at the start or in the initial getaway. But we're back in P2 and now uh, the race is very very long so we need to try and stay as close as possible to Verstappen here come on a good start 
But it ain't over. From here on out, we have to push hard. Very, very hard. Okay, let's go for it. Pretty, pretty good. We're stepping currently within 0.5 seconds. And as long as we can stay close, then that's very beneficial for us. But uh, yeah, man, he's losing. He's, he's already uh, gaining a lot of time here through the last corner alone. Come on, please tell me we have the pace. Please tell me we have the pace compared to him. Uh, BT07, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family. Are you racing against bots? No, no, no. I I've called him up right before the race started. I was like, yo, Verstappen, you want to do uh, a race together? He was like, yeah, bro. So right now, Verstappen battling hard from his uh, simulator at home. Signs as well. Gasly, Leclerc, all of them. Literally, I'm telling you. If you're just joining in, though, in the meantime, a warm, warm welcome. My name is Tom, and uh, I am called The Bomb. Everybody calls me The Bomb, right? Uh, Tom The Bomb. I don't know why, though. You'll see in a little bit, I think. But uh, you're joining in to the Alpine Road to Glory Careers, and it's a pleasure to have you here for uh, what is going to be an awesome, awesome, awesome uh, time. 0 0.4 between the bus and Verstappen. At the moment, we there's not a lot to play for between the bus. But uh, let's see if we can stay as close. That would be great. Uh, A-San, thank you so much for the follow as well. What's up? Welcome to the family. Welcome, welcome. I think we have the pace and the tires are not overheating too. So basically at the moment, I'm just looking at uh, the tires, right? Or at least the temperatures because I do not want the tires to overheat. And at the moment, it looks okay. Even though we're on very heavy fuel, seven tenths of a second, but we are quicker. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the fastest sector then, or the fastest lap, and we are going to be a little bit quicker than Verstappen at the moment. But once the DRS opens, we'll be able to just cling onto his rear, and we don't have to use as much ERS as we are doing right now, because we already have 6% after lap 3. Oh my god, what's that? We have nothing, but we need to use all of the ERS. Otherwise, we're not going to be able to stay close enough to Verstappen. So perhaps we can save a little bit in the middle sector. But uh, we have used a lot of the battery. Actually, everything already in lap 2 out of 71. Because we need to stay close to Verstappen now. Because when the DRS opens, it will be a little bit easier. And we don't need to use as much of the ERS, right? Now, the question is, guys. When do you think the first pit stop is going to happen? Pit stop information. Pit stop information. Oh, here we go. DRS open. 70 laps time for us, which means Verstappen probably is going to go into the bits in lap 20 as well, right? Probably. However, we now have the DRS opening up as well, so that's going to be getting interesting here in uh, staying close to Verstappen. Now, science behind is already 1.2 seconds off from us, so that's not great from his side, right? From For us, it's really, really good. As we open up the BRS right here as well to Verstappen, we're going to save a little bit more now of the uh, of the ERS because we don't need to use as much. Why is your fuel orange? Because we are uh, we're, uh, we underfueled. We underfueled, but we're getting back the fuel already. Don't you worry. Uh, the fuel will be uh, grayed out in a little bit once again. As we close in now to Max Verstappen, could this be the moment already that we attempt a move? I think we should just stay behind for as long as possible. What do you think is the best strategy, guys? Should we go for the move whenever we uh, want to, or should we stay behind? What do you think? Put it up in the chat. Do we go for a move soon, or do we stay behind for the momento? Let's see. Stay behind. Go for the move. Yeah, because if we go for the move, then he will have the DRS, right? Ooh, a little bit tough here then. And now it's uh, 0 0.5 seconds. But we do have the DRS, so we do get closer and closer and closer. Slowly but surely. All right then. Let's see what we can do on this next trade. You are faster? Yeah, but are we fast enough to break the DRS? That's the question. I don't think so, because we're faster right now. It's also due to the fact that we have the DRS. Remember that? The flappity flappity flap. Look, I'll show you right now. Bloop. This flap opening up. Let's see. Now, for those of you who do not know me, by the way... Um Pleasure to meet you. My name is Tom. Uh, I am actually an ambassador of the Alpine Esports team and a uh, content creator, as you can see. But um, it's wonderful to have you here for lap 5 out of 71. I'm telling you, it will be a long race, but every lap we will be on the edge of our seats. I'm telling you that that's what happens over here. Because over here, we don't create a stream, we create a fitting show. Uh, right? That's what we do. Behind, save ERS and undercut with the pit stop. Yeah, I, I guess undercutting is going to be crucial here, guys. 
I guess undercutting is going to be crucial. So going into the pits just a lap earlier than Verstappen and getting the new tires, right? Because we've seen how powerful that is in the in the past. At this track, it is very powerful, powerful as well. Uh, Mizak, thank you so much for the follow. What's up? Welcome to the family. Tom sing us a song. <laughs> Only if we get a subscription. Remember that. When somebody subscribes, we have the Welcome to the Family song coming up. Huh? That's the only time I sing a song. Remember. All right. Come on. Let's see what we can do. Tom, are you hyped for the new F1 game? I am very hyped. I cannot wait. Yo, look at the gaps, by the way, already. Wow. Oh, my goodness. A big gap. It's just science that is able to keep close here to uh, to us. But uh, apart from that, the cars behind are actually leaving a big, big gap uh, already then. So it's a it's a battle for P1, 2 and 3, I think, here. But yeah, I'm one, I'm super, super hyped. Super, super hyped. Yo, guys, let me know. Number one in the chat if you are going to get F122 at launch. Number two if you're like, uh, I don't know. Maybe I'm not going to get it. Maybe I'm going to get it later. Let me know. I'm really hyped for it. Um... I'm very, very uh, interested in seeing more of the game as well and, and trying it out as soon as possible. Oh, one of the Williams has spun. One of the Williams drivers has spun at the moment. One, 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 two, VR. Yeah, guys, guys, let me know. Would you like to see me do a VR stream? Or like every now and then do like a VR stream? I'm not going to do it like, norm like, a, like a normal, but I do want to do a VR stream at some point. Right? That would be cool, right? And then we go into the cockpit cam. Oh my god, we're almost out of the DRS. We're almost out of the DRS. What are we doing? Hello! Will be so much fun. Yeah, it would be cool, right? I just need to get a VR headset. I have no I don't have one yet. Or at least not the one that that works, right? Alright, now we're getting closer again. Oh my goodness, that was a little bit too close for comfort, I'm not gonna lie. On the exit though, we're very close to Verstappen again. But these traction zones are just super Super, super uh, clean. Uh, MRZJIRP. Thank you so much for the follow too. What's up? Welcome in. Uh, if you want to know my setup, uh, exclamation mark setup in the chat. And then there will be a video of me showing my entire streaming room. As well as like my, uh, my sim racing rig and stuff. Uh, but I'm using the uh, Playseed Ultimate Formula Intelligence. Which uh, Playseed provided to me. Uh, with my own logo and stuff on it. It's really cool. It's really cool. I got like a customized, uh, customized, customized play seat Formula Intelligence. It's really cool. And this one is like the one where you are in like a Formula One style cockpit. So I'm actually like laying down right now. It's really cool. Always flexing. <laughs> I'm not flexing. I'm just telling my. I'm, I'm just sharing my excitement, guys. Come on. Uh, Dragon Call Zoe, thank you for the follow. What's up? Welcome to the family. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, 300 followers off of uh, 40,000. Yo, guys, we gotta reach it today, huh? We gotta reach it today. Tell your grandma that we are streaming right now. She has to follow, okay? I, mean, I need all your grandmas to follow right now. We have 40,000. Right? Easy as that. Easy as flipping that. Do it right now. Womboyo, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family. Verstappen struggling, struggling, struggling a little bit more as we get closer and closer. Green sector, Verstappen is going to be uh, getting into that zone now. He has to, because otherwise we are going to be there to profit from mistakes from his side. Uh, v, Nathan, as well as Jackie Sova, as well as uh, Truly Fick. Thank you so much for the, all, uh, for the follows. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much. High five for you. Boom. If you want to high five as well, boom. And make sure you follow. Don't be living in the uh, F1 life in Miami. Yeah. For those of you guys who do not know, I'm going to Miami to get it with Twitch Sports to do a live stream, an IRL live stream. It's going to be super, super cool. Um, and on this channel. So if you want to see me live streaming from Miami during the F1 Grand Prix weekend, then this is the place to be, right? This is the place to be. It's going to be super cool. I'll be taking you guys with me behind, of, um, behind, the, well, behind the scenes of uh, what goes on in Miami throughout the... Uh, throughout the Grand Prix weekend so during no not during quali so during the weekend so I'm not gonna stream throughout the sessions because that would be you guys wouldn't watch <laughs> and I would want to watch the session itself as well I'm not gonna show you the racing you know because uh, F1 is gonna do that 
right? I'll be I'll be showing you the off time. So when there's no racing, then I'll be live, you know. Enjoy the fake water. <laughs> yeah, they invited me for a fake yacht, but uh, I uh, I didn't know they were fake. So uh, now I'm going and I don't have a yacht. What the hell? What the hell? Eternal 92 mode. Uh, thank you so much for the follow. What's up? This was Ado and Riano. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much. Now, we're on lap 9 out of 71. A lap around here doesn't take all too long, but it is also not too short. This race is actually one of the longest races there is. But uh, if we can just keep on the pressure, pressure on Verstappen, then uh, he will crack. Right? You know the famous, uh, the famous saying, don't crack under pressure. With Daniel Kvyat in... Uh, in the Russian Grand Prix in 2017. It was all over. All the billboards. Tuck Hoyer billboards. Don't crack under pressure. And then he, then he did the famous torpedo, right? Exactly what's happening. What's going to be happening right here. Right? Exactly. Eternal 92 mode. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family. What's up? All right. Let's see if we can do a different line. We're stepping. Struggling more and more and more now then. Tom saved some ERS. Yeah. <laughs> It's hard, though, because in the last and final sector, I want to stay close enough to um, to get that DRS. Because if we lose the DRS, uh, we're going to be losing uh, the suck, the, the ketchup, no mayonnaise. Right? We need to keep close to him. That's the most important thing. So that we can go for an undercut. So that we can go for a move. Oh, my God. We're starting to struggle a little bit more now with the tires as well. We will have to go into the pits at some point, though. But when will we do it? That's the question. Pit stop information. Pit stop information. Right, we have two stops left in this strategy. We have two stops planned. Pit window will open in 10 laps time. 10 pit laps time. So that means lap laps. 20... 20. 20. 20. Lap 20. As we close in then, two Verstappen. Ladies and gentlemen, we can go for a Suck. sucky move. As we close in right now then, perhaps we are going to be able to set up the car to go for a move. But do we want to go for a move? I don't think so. I'm not going to lie. I don't really think we should go for a move here because he could break the arrest afterwards. Nah, we stay behind, huh? We have to. Yo, welcome to the family. What's good, you absolute legend? How you doing? Wega, wega, wega. Bonus. Thank you so much for the three-month resub with Twitch Prime as well. Coming in with a primer. We love it. It's prime time. Prime day. Everything is prime. <laughs> thank you so much, bonus. And uh, thank you for, for picking me as your, uh, as your primer. I appreciate you, man. And welcome back in. What's up? Yo, yo, yo. This prediction? What do you mean? Everybody's saying no, huh? I think everybody predicted no on uh, me winning the race. I can't believe it. Why are there no more believers out there, huh? Why are there no more believers out there? Everybody always says, Tom, you suck, you're not gonna win. It's crazy. What have I done to deserve this unbelief? Right? Oh, the majority says yeah. Oh, really? Oh, I thought it was the other way around. My goodness. All right. Here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Now, of course, we're uh, almost a week out now from the Miami Grand Prix. Well, a little bit more than a week. Yeah, no, basically a week, right? Um, Miami, completely, completely new track. Let me know if there's... Um, or what is your most crazy prediction for the Miami Grand Prix in real life? Put it up in the chat. One prediction. The most crazy prediction for the Miami Grand Prix. Whether it's a win for uh, Latifi. Whether you think uh, something else is going to happen. Let me know. Your, your most crazy prediction for the uh, Miami Grand Prix. What do you think? McLaren won too? Okay, okay. Who knows? Miami a new track. So uh, it's a new track. We never know. K-Mac podium. I, I can see that happening. I can see that happening. Oh, that would be cool, though. Haas in their home race getting a podium. That would be really, really cool. Tom will be one of the fake boats. <laughs> uh, right? Just like that. Cruise ship. Right? Uh, I'm a cruise ship. 0 0.7 seconds as we close into Max Verstappen. McLaren new livery. Oh, are they doing that? I haven't heard that. I haven't heard anything about that. Look, look, crash. Oh, no. Oh, perhaps this is like a reverse jinx, huh? It could be a reverse jinx here. 
As we go through these two turns, I think it's a time for a moment for a little bit of an overtake, perhaps on Verstappen as we close. No, we're gonna stay behind for now. I'm gonna show myself though as we go and break super super deep on Verstappen. We go around the outside, keep the inside for the next one, and that means we could go for an overtake then on Max Verstappen. And in lap 13 out of 71, lucky number, we are gonna be leading the Mexican Grand Prix then for the first time in the race. Is this smart though? What do you think? <laughs> Is it smart? I don't know. I don't know. Because he will have the DRS and drive away, doesn't he? Maybe I'll leave him by. I'm not I'm not sure. I'm not sure guys. Look how close he is. I'll go very slow over here and then I'll go and do a flipping amazing attraction attraction. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Give it to me, give it to me, give it to me, give it to me. Give it to me, give it to me. Oh my god! Out of the DRS we go then! Verstappen is gonna close, 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 close. What is this? What is this? Look at that overspeed! Come on. Can win that place back. Okay, I don't think it's smart. I don't think it's smart, what we just did. I think we just need to stay behind and chill. Because right now Verstappen is back in P1 and we, <laughs> we had the lead for literally one second. One second. But now no more DRS for Mr. Verstappen. Now it comes down to uh, us being able to uh, re-overtake him here. And we have to use a little bit of extra ERS as well. But at least we can say, we were leading today. <laughs> we were leading today. I reckon though, we're gonna have plenty more chances to lead because uh, we are going for the win here. And Verstappen needs a DNF. <gasps> oh my God! What happened there? We completely lost the car. What is the tire saying? 37%. Thirty-seven percent, ladies and gentlemen. That's not good. Driver in front. Driver in front. How many pit stops? How many pit stops is he doing? Two stops. Same like same as us. Same as us. Two stop. <gasps> Yo, this is tense, huh? This is pretty tense. Uh, now our standard strategy is to pit in lap 20. Which lap do you think we should pit? Put it up in the chat. What do you think? Which lap do you think we should pit? Now, we could go lap 20, but then we have to go five more laps. I reckon we maybe should go, go like one or two laps earlier, huh? One or two laps earlier. So that we can do the undercut and come out in front of our step and then perhaps even drive away. That would be amazing. That would be amazing. I reckon like lap 19 is like a given. We have to do that at the very least. But maybe lap 18 already for the undercut? I don't know. When is Verstappen going to do it? Look, look, the thing is, if Verstappen goes, we go too, right? If Verstappen goes, we go too, because we don't let him under overcut us. Uh, I mean, we don't have him undercut us. Overcutting is the worst thing you can do around there. So we have to go in as he goes in or we go earlier. And uh, for, for, for the lap that we go earlier, we can decide it together. Either lap 18 or lap 19, right? You won't survive to lap 18? I think we do. We have the DRS on Verstappen, so that's gonna be easy peasy lemon squeezy. Right? I think we should I think we should be able to. 39% now though. Should we go lap 18 guys? We have two laps remaining to do that. Abel well, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family, what's up? We're looking pretty decent so far. We've, we've had some good battle, well, battles. It's, it's more like a mental battle at the moment. Staying behind. We had one battle right here with Verstappen, but it didn't really end well for us right there as he re-overtook us on the same lap even. On the same lap or the next lap. And now he's still back in front, so we need to pick our fights here. We need to be very, very, very cautious at when we want to position the car for an overtake because if we position the car uh, incorrectly, we can lose the DRS and then it's over because Verstappen has some very good pace here. Come on, come on. Okay, I'm starting to get a little bit more understeer. Starting to get a little bit more understeer. If you haven't hit that follow yet, by the way, and you're enjoying yourself right now, then make sure you hit that follow button. You do not want to miss out. I'm telling you right now. Um, make sure you do it. You're going to regret it if you don't do it. And for those of you who have done already, you have made the best decision of your life right there. I will not disappoint you. As we close in to Mac Verstappen 7 tenths, I want to tell you, 
about uh, something that I'm doing right now, and that is uh, to end my studies, I actually am doing a survey. Now, I actually need your help for my research. If you're within 12 to 22 years old, um, only if you're between 12 and 22 years old, uh, it would be amazing if you could fill in my survey about sim racing content uh, and how you view, view it and why you view it. Um, would be amazing. Only if you're between 12 and 22, so don't lie about your age or something like that, because uh, that could not that that will that would not help me. So, only if you're between 12 and 22. Uh, the link is in the chat. Uh, it would be amazing if you could fill it in for me and uh, perhaps share it with with others who are 12 to 22 years old and watch sim racing content because that's very important. Uh, but if you're here, of course, you watch you're watching sim racing content right now, so uh, you are exactly who I need. All right, come on. Not really woke to exclude other ages. I don't care because this is for my uh, research, and uh, in the research you need to make <laughs> you need to make uh, you need to make uh, like a uh, borders, right? Right. Honestly, I've seen on like Twitter and stuff as well some people putting out uh, researches and then people being mad because because they 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 exclude a certain like uh, target group. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> My goodness, some people are crazy. Legend, how you doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome! A year, year now. A year! My goodness! No, that's a whole year, not almost. Oh yeah, it's an entire year. Thank you so much, CLRDT, for the 12 month resub. Legendary! My goodness! Get those yo's in the chat for CLRDT! My goodness. All these complaining. <laughs> no, that's fine. No, I appreciate you guys considering it, but yeah, I only really... It would only help me if you're 12 to 22 years old. Otherwise, it would not help me, so please don't uh, do it if you're not. Uh, where's the survey? Exclamation mark survey in the chat, and it will pop up. And then you can uh, fill it in yourself as well. All right, guys, do we go this lap? Number one in the chat. Number one in the chat. If you think we should go this lap, what do you think? What do you think? Should we go this lap? Should we go this lap? One, one, one. Okay, let's do it. Box this lap. Box this lap. Here we go then. In the pits. Right here, right now as we go. Penalty, what? No? Wait, who's out? One of the Ferraris. What's happening? Everything is going down. 2.8 seconds. Come on. 2.8, 2.8, 2.8. Boom! I'm amazing. Look at that. I literally predicted it correctly. As we go out onto the track right now, Charles Leclerc has gone in the, into the retirement. In the middle of the track, yellow flag and no uh, safety car. Let's hope there will be no safety car or a virtual safety car because then Verstappen is going to gain the maximum amount of time. Now we need to be very, very, very quick with our undercut because if we are not quick right now, we're going to lose out massive, massive amounts of time to, uh, to Verstappen. And in doing so, we would be coming out too far behind if we gain a lot of time right now, which should be the case case then we'll come out in front of Verstappen and we are going to be leading so let's be quick let's be super quick as we look at the tires a little bit trying to push hard I'm not sure if we're gaining time at this point in time but at least we're trying hard at least we're trying hard caution caution oh yellow flag here then for Leclerc and he has been cleared so he's off the track over the track now. Good, 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 good. Are you playing without the safety car? No, we are playing with. Uh, so uh, the safety car can come out at any any point in time. But this time around, it did not. It did not. Uh, Zabi is was uh, Taiko by the F1. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family. It was uh, uh, Soviet as well as uh, Sky Garden. Thank you so much. Will Verstappen go on? Yes, he will. And he's actually getting a little bit stuck now behind of the uh, Haas car. So if we keep it going with the purple second sector, we're going to be able to stay in front of him once he pits. So what do you think? Will we be in front or will Max be in front? Who will be in front then? As Lewis Hamilton puts the fastest lap. Now we gotta put a fastest lap as well here then. We should have the potential to do so. With these brand new tires. But Lewis Hamilton. 13 seconds behind already in lap 20. Crazy, huh? Crazy. And he's already pitted, guys. He's already pitted. But we are green. We're not purple in the first sector. That is interesting. Question is though. Are we gonna be purple in the second sector? Maybe uh, Hamilton got a little bit of slipstream on his lap. 
causing him to get that false slap. But I kind of want the false slap, to be honest. Give it to me! Come on! You'll take these subs to what? Slap 3840? Uh, I don't know. Pit stop information. Pit stop information. Okay, you only have to stop once now. One stop left. Your pit window doesn't open for more Oh, than more than 20 laps. laps. Wait, what? <laughs> we didn't even do 20 laps on these tires on the old ones. <laughs> no! As we get the fastest lap now, it's science pitting, and we overtake him by a flippant country mile then. As he's currently in the pits, how much time are we gaining then? I think huge. Huge amount of time. And I think we're going to be leading this race by a little bit of a margin here over Verstappen. That would be amazing. Max overcutting could be the case, yeah. So that means he has going to be better tired at the end of the race. Better tired at the end of the race. Okay. Uh, Zabi, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family. This could have been very, 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 very uh, beneficial. Or it could have been very, 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 very bad. As Gasly is currently going to be getting slow. So we pop it up the inside with his old tires. And there we go, overtaking him. No blue flags whatsoever. We actually went for uh, for a move right there. With Gasly just being too slow. Look at that. There's so much of a difference between new tires and old tires. It's actually crazy, guys. But look how much time we're gaining on Verstappen. Eight, ten eight tenths once again right here. Is it still undrivable in Season 3 like in my team? Or is it better? No, it's still... Uh, I, I don't know. It feels a little bit better right now. But perhaps that is because I got used to it. But yeah, it, it's very hard to drive in, with an upgraded car. With a fully upgraded car almost. So, yeah. It's very hard. First up and pits, ladies and gentlemen, will we come out in front? He's coming out of the pitch right now. Yes, we have successfully undercut Max Verstappen. And not just by a second, but by three seconds. Actually, four, because we were four or a half a stand behind of him. That means 3.7 seconds over, over him here. My goodness, what an undercut. What an undercut. Uh, Kush Trim, thank you for the follows to you. What's up? Welcome to the show. I appreciate that. If you're just joining in in the meantime, a warm welcome to lap 22 out of 71. My name is Tom. They call me the bomb. Why is that? You're gonna see right here. Oh my god, we're stepping so quick. What? How is he so quick? 2.6. Oh my god, watch out, watch out, watch out. What the hell? A. Rogers, this was ANRS Plays. Thank you so much for the follow. What's up? Welcome to the family. Yeah, I uh, I had the same. At the start of the game, I did my team, and I was in season three, and I um, and I had to quit in the middle of the season because it was undrivable. Um, but um, I uh, I could recommend everybody who starts a career to put the resource development for the, the competition, the AI, and you on reduced. Uh, basically what you get is you get less resource points but in doing so both of you both the ai and you get to upgrade the car a little bit less quickly right and it's basically like it's like standard but then less you won't even notice it you know but in doing so you will um you will not get the issues with the car being undrivable as quickly in your career as uh, you would before when you have standard development uh, in terms of R&D points. So yeah, I could recommend putting it on reduced for any career you do. Uh, Dark Knight, thank you for the follow. What's up? Welcome to the family. What do you study and where? Uh, good question. I uh, I study uh, business studies, basically. The first two years were, uh, were everything there is to know in, uh, in uh, running a su successful business, right? So logistics, uh, finance, uh, human resource, uh, basically everything. And uh, I'm uh, currently majoring in marketing, which... Uh, is basically what I do for a living, right? Because basically, like, my stream is like a it's like a big marketing uh, firm, you know? Like, it's basically a big marketing thing. <laughs> basically. No, but uh, yeah, that's what I'm uh, majoring in. And uh, this is my last year. So once I'm done, fingers crossed that's going to be this year, I will be able to do this full time. What the hell? Max got DRS. What the flip? How is he so quick? He is literally within a second right now. I'm telling you, the Red Bull is still quicker than us. And you know why we were quick? You know why we were quick? Because we had the DRS. That is why. That is why. Don't think you have the pace. <gasps> First up on! Why are you dive bombing us? They're calling me Tom the Bomber, not you. 
We have to defend like a lion. Exactly. You know what we're gonna do, guys? We're gonna be smart. Can you believe it? I think we have to use every bit of our 60 IQ here. And I'm, I'm telling you, that is above average. As Verstappen is closing in already, we have to go and keep the inside. My goodness, he's so quick. Right, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna leave him by. We're gonna leave him by, but where? Over here. Look at this, look at this, look at this, we're smart. We're smart. Okay, focus. We need to stay on As we now get the DRS on Max Verstappen. And we can get back at him. Come on, come on, come on. No hands overtake. No hands overtake. As we go to the left hand side, we break in time. 100 meter board. And Verstappen defends hard here then. He defends super, super hard as we go over the curb, leave a little bit of space on the inside. And that means we're back in P1 with the DRS. Welcome to the family. What's good, you absolute legend? How you doing? Wega, 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 man. Attack, attack, attack. <laughs> exactly. As Verstappen goes for the attack, 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 attack as well. He is going for it, man. Literally, he is going for it. 0 0.4 seconds. Thank you so much, Dragos Popa, for the seven-month resub then. Attack, 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 attack. Now we need to defend, 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 defend like a lion. We need to. We're stepping super close. Will he go for a move? He is struggling a little bit with the rear end. Of course, he has newer tires with the DRS right now then. He tries to go up the inside, and he does so. We try and keep the outside so that we can keep him behind. And then we're going to try and do the exact same thing compared to what we did in this last lap. And we're going to leave Verstappen in front. Come on. Give it to me, huh? Give it to me. Oh my god, that's a big gap. That's a big, big gap. However, we use the ERS, we use the ERS, and we use a little bit of the on Verstappen. Will we go to the right? Yes, we will. As now, we're going to break in time for the first turn, and we're going to battle with Verstappen again. We will break deep, and that means we are going to be inheriting the P1 position once again, and the fight has truly, truly unleashed with Verstappen. Verstappen now, without the ERS, having a quicker exit, and he's going to go to the right-hand side to try and outbreak us. There's a yellow flag then. He cannot overtake us. He cannot overtake us. It's Kimi right who is out of this session, out of the race. He is retired and he's parked up onto the grass on the right hand side and we still managed to take P1 for now with Sainz getting to go and uh, join into the fight very, very soon as well. It's about to get very, very interesting, huh? Why not use him to get away of Sainz? We can do so as well. We can do so as well as now Verstappen goes for the move already. With that DRS. So we cannot leave him by um, before we get onto the onto the straight right there. So we just need to stay as close as possible here. Just look at how quick he is, though. It's crazy. Still 0 0.4. And we get the DRS again, so we can get back at him. Uh, Don Kratos, this was Unvsen and Lil Il Pacho. Thank you so much for the follow. This time around, we go to the left because we're stepping the fancy inside like a madman. And we are going to be inheriting P1 again. It's like a trade-off. It's like a cat and mouse game. He overtakes us, we overtake him. And so forth. But now I think we are going to be able to keep him behind. Purple first sector in using... Verstappen's ERS and DRS, or uh, DRS, I mean, and Slipstream. And Sainz is getting closer and closer to get involved in that fight as well. We can see him right behind, lurking, getting closer. The question is, what do we do? What do you think we should do? Should we keep on battling, or should we try and uh, let Verstappen overtake and uh, stay behind in P2? What do you think? I will leave him by here, though, because if we don't leave him by, he will overtake us. So we have to leave him by. Will he do it, though? Will he do it? That's the question. He will. Now, we're going to make a mistake at one point, and we're going to lose the DRS. I'm telling you right now, huh? It's going to happen. It's going to happen. We're, we're going to lose the DRS. So it's going to be crucial here. Defend P1. Stay P1. Okay. 
That is exactly what we're gonna be doing then. Lap 28 out of 71, and we re-overtake Verstappen on the outside, but Verstappen now is gonna go deep. We do a switchback though, and in doing so, we will inherit P1 once again. Verstappen was very optimistic with that move there then, as now he's gonna go and pull up to the right-hand side, but with that DRS that we have, we can defend from him just about. Oh my goodness! We are seeing some different moves happening right now with uh, Mazapan being their blue flag. He needs to get out of the way in a decent position. There you go. That is perfecto mundo. Now, please don't leave Verstappen by. He did. <laughs> he did do it. Okay, then. Uh, Marka Kihan, uh, as well as uh, TikTok Jimmy. Thank you so much for the follow. What's up? Talking about TikTok. I actually have TikTok as well, guys. If you want to see me twerking, exclamation mark TikTok in the chat. If you want to see me twerking. Also, if you want to join the Discord, make sure you do so. Because over there, the entirety of the community is at. And if you want to use the 2022 liveries in the... <gasps> oh, no! No! We were... There we go! We're stupid! We're stupid! We're actually stupid! And now signs comes and goes and takes p1 oh my goodness Sa yes! he actually goes to deep he looks at the tires and we reclaim p1 what was that yes oh my goodness beautiful beautiful signs is gonna go very very hard into that corner and Verstappen was on the outside the two teammates collide and we retake p1 oh my goodness what was that uh martin src thank you so much for the follow as well as toby no uh, thank you so much for the follow as well i appreciate that beautiful that's what happens over here guys you never know what will happen all right we need to leave uh, signs in front here then just he needs to just go for the move because uh, i do not want to have no drs once again come on come on come on no no for step as well no 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 oh my god what are we doing as we actually do a very very good move on for step and then and uh, oh my god that's what i'm telling guys uh, it's almost impossible now that everybody's so close but we're gonna get those the signs here come on 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 it's chaos actual chaos all right carlos i'm coming for that position i'm coming for that position you had drs for schumacher oh are you serious i did not know i did not know as now it is going to be carlos Sainz leading the race that's very good for us that's very good for us because verstappen needs to earn uh not so many points the minimum amount of points as possible for us to be able to uh, win the championships or at least be in contention for the championship right so yeah we kind of need verstappen to uh crash so science if you could help me mate that would be amazing would be amazing oh my goodness what a crazy race so far yo guys let me know in the chat has it been a decent race so far i think it has huh i think it has all right come on Closing into signs. Oh, we're getting a little bit of struggles now with the exit. 0 0.6. And I think that's too far already for us to be able to go for a move. So let's stay out of it for now. And let's go on to the DRS. Let's go on to the DRS. As you break at the 100 meter board in the third gear. Come on, come on, come on. Perhaps this is going to be good enough already. but we do look and now it's gonna be a uh, now it's gonna become a little bit tougher because we don't have the overhand in the middle of the track and that is where he's able to punch a little bit of a gap compared to us mr carl signs however though verstappen doesn't seem to really be able to uh to catch up to us 0 0.8 seconds does he have a problem does verstappen have a problem after that touch with uh, with carl signs could well be the case Verstappen dive, dive bombed? No, it was actually Carlos Sainz who dive bombed Verstappen. <laughs> Carlos Sainz went for uh, went for a big dive up the inside and uh, he went way too deep and he hit Verstappen. And in doing so, we actually were able to get two positions in one corner. So that was a mental. That was good.
Uh, Dave Vance, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family. And if you're just joining into the show today, a warm, warm welcome and left 36 out of 71. Uh, I am pausing the game because we are going to save the game <laughs> and then we're going to continue uh, if you haven't yet joined the discord guy, by the way guys yet yeah, make sure you do so link in the chat over there you can also go and download the livery mods that we have uh, that we're using right now uh, so if you want to use them the 2022 liveries you can uh, you can go and uh, watch any of the episodes on the tom replay youtube channel boom link is in the chat too get subscribed because over there you will be able to watch all the episodes of the alpine road to glory career and whatever we do in the future you don't want to miss out so check it out Guys, my ass is hurting. Can somebody can somebody help me or something? Uh, let me take a sip of water and then we'll continue uh, right about and now. Cool. Did Tom pit yet? We did. Once. We pit it once. We pit it once. New strategy option. No, no, no. They want us to do an extra pit stop. Driver in front. Driver in front. Signs ahead. The gap is less than a second. How many laps? Yeah, also one more stop. All right, we're gonna go for it. Ladies and gentlemen, we are gonna go for it. Very, very deep on Carlos Sainz. Super deep around the outside, meaning the inside of the turn is ours. And we go and make the position back in P1. The battle here has been really, really, really close. Alonso continues. You mean that Alpine? No, in our career, he, uh, he, uh, he retired, yeah. Yeah, we, uh, we replaced Ocon, right? In the first season that we did. So we had one season with Alonso. And, um, and then he retired straight away. He was, he was embarrassed. He was like, no way, I'm getting beaten. But like crazy here. Oh no, they have the DRS now. Come on, get a good exit. Get a good exit. Science is gonna go and use the slipstream. Look at how much overspeed, man. No! And he overtakes us. All right, we're gonna stay as close as possible. Science will retake that position then. Come on, get the exit, get the exit, get the exit. No, oh, and we're stopping now. We'll try and go for move two. We're the only one here now then, without the DRS. And there is a race update in the chat for those of, for those of you who do not really know what has been. Hello, Verstappen tried to go for a move. For anybody who doesn't know what happened so far, perhaps you're just joining in. A warm, warm welcome. Uh, you're joining into lap 33 out of 71 in the chat. There is a little bit of an update for you to go and uh, and read up on, and then you'll know exactly what has happened so far in this race. Uh, Chiara Valle, uh, thank you so much for the follow. For those of you who haven't yet followed, make sure you do so. You do not want to miss out, and I'll give you a high five right now. I'll give you a high five right now. Literally, okay? If you follow. Uh, Nani Bunny! Boom! High five for you. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate that. That was the best decision you can make today, man. The best decision. Or girl, for that matter. Allah, let's go. Allez, allez, allez! Bonjour, mes amis. Hola, mi amigos. Hello, alle zaman. Hello, meine Freunde. Hello, alle mal. Merhaba. Giesas. Habari. Konnichiwa. Ni hao. Good day, mates. Wherever you're from in the entirety of the world, uh, let me know in the chat right now. We have mo literally, we have the most nationalities ever, right? We are the most diverse Twitch chat in the entirety of Twitch. I'm telling you right now. Put it up in the chat. Where are you watching from right here, right now? Uh, I am from the Netherlands myself, for anybody who's wondering. And the Netherlands. Uh, uh, Netherlands, Portugal, Spain, Belgium, France, Luxembourg. India, look at that. Netherlands, Czech. Japan. Italy. Mauritius. Uh, Switzerland, Croatia. Look at that. Amazing. Germany. All over the world. And we're all coming together, united, to have some fun, huh? So let's have some fun and let's close in on uh, Mr. Carlos Sainz. We're struggling with the rear of the car now. You can see we are starting to, to step out a little bit. And uh, we, need to, we need to stay into the arrest because we're stepping now. We'll go for a move. No! Don't do it. 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 We will break deep with Verstappen on the inside, so we have to give him a little bit of space. And that will hinder us in trying to close into Carlos Sainz then. 
but luckily we didn't really get, lose a lot of time here all right we're still there we just need to get closer to Carlos Sainz though all right let's go hey over we're stepping we're stepping hit us what was that move and now we will have a little bit of trouble trying to stay close enough 0 0.6 seconds to Carlos Sainz and perhaps we're gonna lose the DRS here soon on Carlos Sainz oh no 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 and he has DRS as well get the flip out of the way Jovinazzi get the flip out of the way Jovinazzi get the flip out of the way Jovinazzi what are you doing we have to go wide and everybody is sabotaging us we might not even be able to get the DRS here on Carlos Sainz this is not going to plan sabotage is happening uh, Dennis, Daniel, Spooky Tibu, boom, high five for you. Thank you so much for the follows. Welcome to the family. What's up? As well as Zira and Xpika. Thank you so much for the follows as well. High five for flipping you. You guys are awesome. Thank you. All right. Luckily, though, we came out unscathed. But uh, yeah, that was very tough. Tires are struggling more and more. 35% on the tires. The question is, medium tires coming in soon, but when? Pit stop in formation. Pit stop in formation. One stop to go. One stop left in this strategy. Six laps until your pit window is open. They are telling me lap 42. What do you think? I think we should go lap 40, undercut, medium tires, and then come out in front of them all, and then have a battle towards the end of the race. Put it up in the chat. What do you think? What do you think? I think we should go lap 40. I think we should go lap 40. Lorenzo Coca-Cola. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family. This was Dano. What's up? You have joined in to the most exhilarating show there is currently on Twitch. So chill back and relax. Get some popcorn, get some milkshake and get entertained. Because this is going to be one hell of a race from here. As we are in lap 37 out of 71. What's for Verstappen again? You guys saying like 40, 40, 39? He's so much quicker than us at the moment, guys. As he's on the inside, we do the exact same thing. But now we're going to start struggling a little bit more because we, we pitted earlier. Remember that? We pitted earlier, so our tires are getting off the cliff. Over the cliff. Sooner than them. No first step and no first step and no first step and. Don't go up the inside as well, man. Literally, man. Yeah, he's dive bombing in that corner all over the place. How do you get that car? Uh, if you put exclamation mark mod in the chat, exclamation mark mod, then there will be a link in the chat to my Discord. In there, I have the, the link to uh, download the 2022 liveries if you want to, and you can use them uh, use them in the game there. But it's a uh, it's a mod. It's uh, it's not available in the in the game itself. Luke, I as well as Luke and Lorenzo, and as well as Basha. Thank you so much for the follows too. And you guys are coming in hot with the follows. I appreciate that, man. Thank you. All right, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, it's getting tough now. Again, we're stepping super close. So he's going to attempt another move here. 100%. He's going to attempt another move here. Look at that overspeed. Stay there! Oh, my God. This is not healthy. This is not healthy. We're stepping over the curbs. Luckily, though, he wasn't affected all too much by it. Come on, again, again, again. He's still there. Stay there, man. I, literally. I'll slap your ass. Come on. Good, 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 good. Uh, Aaron's. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the... <gasps> what are you doing, man? You don't go for a move there. And again, he tries it. Yeah, exit of the last turn uh, is crazy for, uh, for science. For some reason, they're like... Really, really good over there. Okay, now we're struggling again. And now Sainz has DRS. It's literally the wrong moment here. Latifi, not again. No, 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 no. You don't do this to me. We have to go super wide to actually go and get around Latifi. Why are we sabotaged by all the blue flags? And it's it's a second. It's a second to Sainz. No, give me DRS. No! We're losing DRS, and now we need to make a decision. Now we need to make a decision. We have to go into the pits here. Verstappen overtakes us. This is the moment. 
We have 30 laps to go. And we probably need to go into the pits now for the medium tires to go to the end of this race. Guys, do we pit for the undercut? Do we pit for the undercut this lap? We don't have the arrest right here as well. Do we pit for the undercut? It's now or never. Put a number one in the chat if you think we should go for the medium tires. New mediums to go to the end of the race. Do an undercut. Come out in front of all of them. We have seen in the first pit stop that if we do the undercut, go in earlier compared to them, we can come out in front of them by a decent margin so that we are able to just stay in the fight here. And we don't have the quicker car, as you can see, but we can play it smart. But that's up to you, because remember, all of you who are watching, you're part of the engineering team. You guys get to decide what we do. So what do we do? That is the question. George, thank you for the follow too. What's up? One, one, one. Okay, we're going to do it then. Box this lap. Box this lap. Or not. No, we're still there. We still have the DRS. One more lap, 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 one Lap 40. Books this lap. Books this lap. Put your boxes in the chat. Ladies and gentlemen, we will be pitting this lap so that we can go and do the other cut on Verstappen and Sainz and that we can come out in front of them. It was very good to stay out one more lap because look how close we are still. We have to do the pits of this lap. Uh, B Booze, thank you for the follow. What's up? Welcome to the family. Very good. Very good. I <laughs> put my boxers in the chat. <laughs> I'll be very clear next time. As we go on to second gear in the third, ladies and gentlemen, we will be pitting, but will they be pitting? That is the question. I hope not. If they are, we are not going to have an advantage. But no, they don't go into the pits. We do, though. And we go sideways. Boom. Easy. 2.7 seconds. 2.7 seconds. 2.7 seconds. What do you think it's going to be? 2.7. Here we go. Boom. Oh my god. <laughs> Did you see that flipping timing when I when I went down with the with the clutch? That was crazy. Like alien. Alright, come on. That is the winning move? I do believe so as well. But we are gonna be quicker with these medium tires now then. So the undercut is near. But they have the DRS on each other, right? Verstappen and Sainz have the DRS on each other. So that could be also what is gonna hinder me being able to make this a winning move. Because last time around when we did the undercut, they did not have DRS on each other helping each other, getting each other to go and uh, get quicker and quicker and uh, and keep a decent lap time compared to uh, before. But let's go and push all out so that we can do the undercut. Tires still a little bit cold, so we're uh, understeering a little bit, going too deep, not being able to brake in time for the turns. Uh, these medium tires, of course, are a little bit slower as well. But now, science, 19.6 seconds. That means four tenths gained already. Will they pit this lap? That is the question. Let's take a look and see. But from here on out, it will be a race from here to the end no more pit stops whatsoever no more pit stops 19.2 colin thank you so much for the follow welcome to the family and welcome to the 41 out of 71 if you're just joining in at this point in time you are very much welcome uh, my name is tom they call me the bomb right why do they do that because i'm very sexy number one in the chat if everybody always calls me the bomb let's just confirm it right here right now all right everybody always does that Everybody, they always come into the chat like, oh my god, Tom, how how are you so beautiful? I'm like, I don't know, it's natural. Uh, Very, thank you for the follow, as well as Alessandrino. Uh, we break it the 100 meter board, and as you can see, uh, Science is gaining time because he has the DRS, and this is exactly what I was talking about before. Um, they have the DRS here, so we can't gain as much time as we want to. We can't gain as much time as we want to. So we all we just need to do it by uh, by pitting earlier and uh, hoping for the best in sector two and sector three. 18.8 seconds. So we are gaining. The question is though, how long is the pit stop around here? How long is the pit stop around here? That is the question. And when are they pitting? Because I hope I don't hope I hope they're not gonna wait all too long still because then our tires at the end are gonna be very bad. But we needed to do this. 
We needed to do this. 18.4 in the meantime. And we're gonna have the DRS on uh, uh, Gasly very, very soon. Like uh, Ricardo likes to say it. Pierre Gasly! That guy who is right in front of us. 2.3 seconds, 18.4 uh, to signs. And I think the pit stop is like 20 seconds or something like that, right? So, should be good. Uh, Crit Seed Zini. Uh, thank you for the follow as well. Welcome in. High five to you. Boom. If you haven't yet... Uh, oh. If you haven't yet... Uh, oh, what are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? If you have not yet followed or subscribed to the Tom Replay channel, there we go, then make sure you do so. Uh, the link is in the chat over there. I uh, have all the episodes, so um, you better go and get subscribed because... Uh, all of the streams that we do are on there in about half an hour, I think, or something like that, at 2 p.m. Central Europe time, which is in half an hour. There we go. Perfecto. Um, the race from Singapore went live, or is going to go live, and that race was literally half a, se half a minute or something close to being uh, checkered flagged because of the max time of the race. It was two hours. The race was literally two hours, and that is the maximum time you can do a race. So it would, uh, it would actually be checkered flagged there. We were very close to it. Science pits. Will we be in front? That is going to be crucial. Medium tires. Do we have DRS? Come on. Yes, we do. Science pits. See you later. Science goes out of the pits. And look at how many seconds that is then. Compared to us and science, that is actually... 2.8 seconds, 3 seconds then. But you'll see how quickly science is gonna go and um, <laughs> regain that time, right? Because he's just quicker. Those those Red Bull cars are, are just a sec like half a second quicker or something like that. Now now we know that we are gonna be ahead of Max Verstappen as well. So ladies and gentlemen, the undercut has worked once again. Now it's gonna be crucial to see how quick we can be on these medium tires compared to the softs uh, of which we were on before, right? Now Gasly's a little bit in the way right here. Get the flip out of the way. Multi 69, multi 69. Get me the flip out of here. Confirm that. We'll be moving the front wing to a balanced setting next time you're in. What? What do you mean? No, I don't want that. Multi 69 does not mean balanced flipping front wing. It means we'll get the flip out of the way here, Gasly. That's what it means. Gasly helping Red Bull could be the case as Verstappen now is going to go and hello Verstappen pits as well and we might lose out here no we don't because look at that Verstappen loses out on Carlos Sainz who is actually 1.6 behind of us already and they come out literally side by side to each other all right this is going to be interesting Ladies and gentlemen, we are leading the Mexican Grand Prix here then in um, round 8 out of 10 of our short last and final season. This is season 3, the last season of Alpine Road to Glory. Now, if you want if you want to watch back any of the seasons, any of the episodes, you can do so, like I said, on the Tom Replay channel. So if you haven't yet gone and checked it out, do so. Uh, if you want to watch it on Twitch, then you can do so as well. But then you'll have to be a subscriber. But don't, don't, don't worry. You can also watch back anything for free on the Tom Replay channel. Uh, exclamation mark replay. You can watch back all the replays for absolutely nothing. Is this career mode? Uh, yes, it is. This is actually a driver career mode. We started all the way in Formula 2. Uh, but that season is not on the Tom Reaper channel because I started the channel right as we went into the last race. Only the final race of the season is on the Tom Replay channel. Uh, Charlie Chuck, thank you for the follow too. What's up? Who has the fastest lap? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, yeah, it's on, it's on regular corner cutting. Regular. We don't care about strict over here. We, we care about good putting on a good show. And that is it. Even though I qualified for the F1 Esports Pro Draft, I don't have aspirations to sweat my ass over and, uh, and get the penalty in the end and, uh, and uh, finish the race 20 seconds behind. <laughs> We don't want that. Other people do that, right? But not me. Uh, TRL Triple. Thank you so much for the follow. Oh, welcome to the family. What's up? Yeah, they have the DRS. We're, we're back to uh, where we were before. We are going to have 25 laps here of trying to defend. Now, what I think we should do, guys, I think we should give the position to Carlos Sainz and then re-overtake him. That is what I think we should do. 
give the position to Carlos Sainz and then re-overtake him. Or Verstappen, I mean. Verstappen P2, oh my goodness. Red Bull will uh, snack your next level. I hope not. But yeah, look how close they are. All right, what we're going to do? Look at this, look at this, look at this. Now we are smart. And we are going to give the position to Verstappen because he was too close for comfort. Here we go then. In the DRS. So Max Verstappen into the... Oh, let's go. Uh-oh, signs. Uh-oh, signs. No, no, no. Yo, they're quick on the straight. We pop up the inside now, though. Oh, it's it's three wide. It's literally three wide. And we touch. We touch just about. But we keep it here. Come on. You know what we can do? You know what we can do? We can go very slow. You're thinking, what the flip are you talking about? Nah, okay, no, never mind. Stroll's gonna leave us by because there's blue flags already. We're stepping, we're stepping, we're stepping. What are you doing? Already looking for moves then. Already looking for moves. All right. You're uh, you're tuning in right now for one of the most epic battles you've ever seen. We're gonna have a battle here with the Red Bulls all the way to the end of the race, but we are alone here. We're home alone. With Verstappen already going for the move. All right, we'll slot in behind. We'll slot in behind of him. And we gotta just stay as close as possible with these medium tires and then go for a re overtake. Oh my god, he's gonna have DRS, is he? <gasps> oh my god, it's literally stupid. I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. He doesn't have DRS! Yes! W. As now, we are going to go and make it three wide with Stroll inside once again. Break deep. And that's going to be P1 once more with Carlos Sainz coming through as well. It's going to be a cat and mouse game all the way to the end. Easy. Will there be backmarkers anytime soon? It will be Vettel or uh, whoever is in the Aston Martin. I'm not sure who is in the Aston Martin at the moment. In the other Aston Martin. Oh no, oh no, oh no. We're stepping, man. What is that? <laughs> Every lap he tries to put his flipping front wing up the inside then. Vettel retired? Ah, uh, you're right. I forgot. Vettel retired. Yeah, I remember. Because last season we were battling with Vettel for the championship. Because Vettel was... Um, one of the Red Bull uh, drivers. And we were battling with the champ for the championship with him. We annihilated him in the last and final race to win the championship. And uh, because of that he retired. Because he could not handle the L. No, 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 no. Don't go up the inside. Don't go up the inside. What are you doing? No. Sainz <gasps> lost the car. Ladies and gentlemen. Sainz lost the car. Hey, yo, that was his fault, man. That was his own fault. That was his own. Yeah. Number one in the chat, there was Sainz's fault. Number two in the chat, there was Sainz's fault. What the hell is that? I'm not having it. 0 0.4 then to our championship rival Max Verstappen. Yeah, look. Everybody's saying it's Sainz's fault. He put it up the inside there where you won't expect it. I left him plenty of space around the outside. Or in on the inside. He tr decides to go deep just like he's done with Verstappen. Looks up the tires, hits my rear. Boom, shakalaka. He is the other way around. And now he's back in P4. So no podium for Sainz at the moment. With Hamilton currently on the soft tires, but I, don't, I think Hamilton has another pit stop to go. Yo, we're stepping so quick. 0 0.6 at the moment. We need to be quicker here, man. Otherwise, we're going to lose out on, uh, on the DRS here soon. Come on. 0 0.7. We need to gain back time. It's going to be literally between Verstappen and us now. Signs out of the equation. 1 plus 1 is 3. Exactly. Out of the equation. There are 21 more laps to go. There are indeed. The question is, will Verstappen decide to uh, torpedo us and have the same fate as, uh, as uh, Mr. Carlos Sainz? Yes or no? It would be great. As long as it's not my... Not my fault, you know? Uh, Jurai, thank you for the follow as well as Ezelito. Thank you so much, guys. Welcome to the family as well as uh, Lucas and Enzo Bamba. If you haven't yet followed, make sure you do so. We are one follower off. No, like 10, right? From 40,000. 
So if all of you follow right now, we will be there. Almost. I think we need 400 or something. It's like, it's the same as 10, come on. 0.9 now to Verstappen, he's literally getting so much time. 1.0 out of the DRS. No. No. I'm not having it. We need, to, we need to focus. If we are out of the DRS right here, that could mean the end. <gasps> Just about we're not. This is so, so important. So important, guys. Come on, 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 come on. Zero ERS actually as well. HLXB, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the family. In the third gear. Over the cubes hard. And we take different lines, and we're already once again four tenths of a second behind old Mr. Verstappen. Race update in the chat from uh, our very personal engineer. Remember, all of you who are watching are the engineers as well. You get to decide what we do. So you tell me to dance, I will dance. You know it. But uh, yeah, in the chat, if you want to catch up with everything that's happened so far, you can read up on it right now. Thank you, PP. 0.6 to Verstappen though. This is where we need to watch out because we saw he was super quick in this section. Look at that, how quick he is. Super quick. Uh, Papa Lobster, as well as Beef Leaf TV. Thank you for the follow, what's up? 0 0.6. And if you're just joining in, a warm, warm welcome to the 51 out of 71. Uh, you're joining into the middle of the Mexican Grand Prix and it's been an exciting one so far. Uh, for those of you who do not know me, my name is Tom and they call me The Bomb. Why is that? I don't know. I don't know, you'll see very soon. Oh my god, my ass hurts. Oh. Uh, Sayakas, thank you so much for the follow, what's up? In the third gear, over the curbs. We are just not close enough to go for a move just yet, but it will happen, guys, don't worry. We need to save a little bit of ERS, but he's just so quick right now on the mediums, man. He's so quick on the mediums. I need to push all out every single lap, man. It's crazy. All right, here we go. Take a break if your ass hurts. <laughs> nah, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. I need more than a break for uh, for what I have down there. All right, come on. We're stepping. I am coming for you. Save the race. Yeah, I'll, I'll do so on the straight. Uh, Henrique, thank you for the follow too. What's up? Welcome to the family. Do you have another pit stop? No, we have done every pit stop so far. We've done a soft, soft, medium strategy. And with these mediums, we should be able to go to the end of this race. What happened to science? I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. I do not want to talk about it. Okay. Let me quickly save the game. Right over here. There we go. Boom. Also, guys, for anybody who has not yet, um, I, uh, I'm actually uh, working on my final thesis, my final research for my studies, and then after that, I hope to be done. Um, it's about sim racing and um, about why and why you watch sim racing, but... If you're between 12 and 22 years old, it would be absolutely amazing if you could fit in my survey. It only takes like five minutes. It would be absolutely amazing uh, if you watch sim racing content. And I mean, you're, you're watching sim racing content right now. Uh, but only if you're 12 to 22 years old. If you're older or younger, please don't fill it in because then it's actually not going to help me. But if you're b between 12 and 22 years old, it would be absolutely amazing. The link's in the chat. Uh, if you could click that link and, and fill it in for me, that would be so, so awesome. Uh, but only if you're between 12 and 22 years old. Thank you. All right, let's close. Uh, let's close into the end of the race. Then here we go. Boom. I feel too old, man. <laughs> uh oh. I watched your video to turn off the assist, and it helped me so much. You're welcome, man. No worries whatsoever. I'm happy to see that. And welcome into the to the stream of today, man. The show. Remember, over here we don't do streams, okay? Over here we don't do streams. Over here we do shows. Uh, I'm 25, sorry mate. Don't worry, man. Thank you for considering anyhow. Already done, fam? Hell yeah, bro. Thank you. A lot of back markers up. Uh-oh, that's not gonna be great. They're gonna be getting in our way here, guys. Especially if it's before the breaking zone after this next trade. Welcome to the family. What's good, you absolute legend? How you doing? Wake up, wake up, wake up, man. E -R, a buddy. E -R. 
Can I get an ER in the chat, guys? ER. <laughs> Thank you so much, Dennis Trico, uh, for an ER. And welcome back to the uh, subscription family with the Twitch Prime. Oh, we love it. Thank you, man. Did the game crash lately? No. No, it has not crashed lately, so uh, I'm happy about that. But just to be sure, I like to save the game every now and then. Um, because if it does crash, then I'll be crying, you know? In 100% in races, it's best to just save it every now and then. It's not a big hassle anyway, you know? I wish it saved automatically. That would be great. Maybe in the future, we'll have, we'll have like an auto-save. Uh, Jorge Tier, thank you so much for the follow, as well as Papa Schulz. What up, Papa Schulz? Hello, my friend. Hello, hola, uh, Bonjour, mes amis. Uh, hola, mes amigos. Hello, hola, zaman. Yes, how are you? There you go. Welcome, wherever you're from. 0 0.8. Okay, Verstappen is driving away here. He's going to get DRS as well. This is not going to be good for us. This is not going to be good for us. Oh, not again. Not again. <gasps> oh my god, he just about went out of the way. Are we winning the DRS still? <gasps> just about. 0 0.8. <gasps> Watch out. Oh my god. It's getting tough right now. 0 0.9 and we're losing time now to Verstappen. We need to go for a move somewhere, but where are we going to do it? I think we need to just try and stay close enough in the last couple of laps to go for a move. And set it up maybe like right over here. Because we're super quick in this corner, but if we don't, if we can't stay close enough to him, then yeah, that's going to be uh, that's, that's gonna be a little bit of an issue. We need to save some ERS to be able to stay close enough to him. Oh, uh, DeVille, thank you for the follow too. What is up? Welcome in. Different line. Different line to Verstappen. Save the battery for five laps. Yeah, I'm going to try to, but the, it's very tough because we need to be close enough to Verstappen or at least stay close enough. And for that, I need to use some of the battery. But let's try and not use unnecessary battery because I guess we're using unnecessary battery as well right now. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Ooh, a little bit of look up. Stay close though. 0 0.5. It looks like if we focus up, if we focus up, we can be close enough to Verstappen. But we need to do perfect laps then. All right. Let's just start saving up. And look at that. Without using a lot of the ERS, we're going to be fast. It's 115.8, so we do have it in the car. Ladies and gentlemen, 115.8, so we do have it within the car at this moment in time. Are you manual or automatic gear? I am completely Emmanuel. If you want to become better at racing without any assist whatsoever, then make sure you go and get uh, subscribed to my main YouTube channel. Completely free. And I have amazing videos on there to help you get better. Uh, if you watch this video, no assist guide, then you will become 5 tenths a lap quicker instantly. I'm telling you right now. Uh, 216 IQ. That's how much IQ I have, right? As well as uh, Zambap BJ. Thank you so much for the follow. What's up? As we go into second gear, now we're closing into first step, and it might be that he is going to start struggling with his tires a little bit more. Now, let me know in the chat. Whose team are you on? Whose team are you on? Let's see. Are you on team Verstappen or are you on team Tom? Put it up in the chat. I swear. If, if I see team Verstappen's out there, huh? I will ban you. Right here. Right here, right now. Team Max. Team Verstappen. Okay, then. Mods. You know what to do. You know what to do. Alright, not, let's not use any of the ERS, but he has DRS right now, I think. Uh, it's so it's so stupid. We don't want them. We don't want those uh, those back markers, because Verstappen will get DRS because of them, and it's just gonna be painful. Look again! Oh my god, please get out of the way for me, please get out of the way for me, please get out of the way for me. Hello, Perez, what are you doing? Why are you not getting out of the way for me? Hello! Here, my teammate! I feel like everybody's against me today, huh? Everybody, even my teammate. Even my teammate is against me today, huh? You guys are against me. <laughs> my teammate is against me. All the back markers are against me. 
I'm not having a very easy day here, huh? Third gear, fourth gear, as we close in, to Verstappen. Lap 57 out of 71, only 14 laps remain to see if we can win this race. I think we can, but it will go down to... Uh, Oh my god, oh my god, we're stepping. <laughs> Put in the fastest lap. Alright, we have a little bit of, a, of, of some clean air. Without a lot of uh, back markers. So that's really good for us for the last 14 laps, huh? That's very good for us. Ooh, watch out. Come on, come on. DRS open. Let's save more ERS. His tires are fresher, yeah, but only two laps. So that's not really going to make too much of a difference, huh? They're only a little bit fresher, his tires. Will there be one more stop? No, there will not. Unless you think, Tom, go for soft tires right now, you'll be able to be quicker in the end. 13 laps to go, two seconds per lap quicker than him. What do you think? Soft tires? I don't know, man. I don't know. We could do it, but we do need to decide now. Literally this lap. Because we don't have a lot of time left, you know, to do it. We tried that last time and uh, it was super wrong. Yeah, true. True, 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 true. Signs will be in front of you, uh, but with the soft tires, we'll overtake him within one lap. Don't pit. Okay. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. In the third gear, then, as we close into Verstappen, it's we're still close. Uh, I still believe we can do this. Yeah, we lose. Yeah, we lose in the sector two and sector three. No, sector. Yeah, I don't know, man. Uh, the first couple of turns are our strongest points, and then this middle sector is pretty decent as well. Third sector, we're not we're not good. Mostly third sector, we're losing. But because we're losing in the third sector, we are not able to go for a move on the main straight. And uh, straight after that, right? So, yeah, that's a little bit of an issue right here. But uh, we'll try and see if we can figure it out compared to uh, what we've done earlier in the race as well. Because we have done some moves before. Uh, Doof Daddy, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family. 12 laps remaining. And you're joining in to the Alpine Road to Glory career. Mexico right here, right now. Ladies and gentlemen, Verstappen has been leading the race for the majority, but we have been close every single lap. We have been breathing in his neck. <laughs> like that. And I can smell him. What the hell is this? It smells like rotten fish. What have you eaten yesterday? Verstappen. That is not good. All right, we're close now. I think the longer he goes, the, the more tire he is going to get here. It doesn't look like you're going to overtake because he's so fast. Remember, over here we do the impossible. Over here we live to do the impossible. It may seem impossible at the moment. But uh, I think it will become possible here if we keep believing. Martin AV is was Royal Flush. Thank you so much for the follow. What's up? Welcome to the family. Yo, look how quick he is in the second sector, man. He gains like four tenths. Out of nowhere. RKO out of nowhere, huh? If you're enjoying yourself, make sure you hit that follow button. Um, I will give you a high five in return. All right, come on. We're stepping. I'm coming for you. <gasps> watch out, watch out. You should have uh, you should have books, had nothing to lose, things to gain. Well, we had the P1 to lose because we're fighting for P1. If we couldn't uh, catch up, then, you know. ESDs was Mr. Rickles. Boom, high five for you. Thank you so much for the follow. Because remember, we only had 12 laps to do anything. And Verstappen is the quickest driver out on track. Would we be two seconds per lap quicker? That's the question. We're still battling for P1 at the moment. We're literally right there. So we were not we are not desperate. Remember that. We are not desperate at the moment. But uh we do need to go for for a move later on because probably last lap. If we want to go for a move, we need to do it last lap. Don't use so much ERS yet. We're going to try and uh, not use a lot of ERS here. Or at least as minimum as possible so that we can set ourselves up later on in the race. Oh, 
Oh my god. There will be some back markers now again. Oh, I, I hate it. Look, the thing is. First of all, why do they go in my way? <laughs> Second of all, why does Verstappen get the DRS and I never get the DRS because of back markers? Uh, obviously, he's the one who is uh, behind them first. So he will get the DRS, but... Does he have DRS now? That's the question. Please no, please no, please no, please no, please no. No. Okay, cool. Then we can just use no ERS. Come on! Andrea Miato, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family as we break deep here then for the first turn. On Verstappen, there will be uh, some tangling up here, I think. With these drivers. Joe may not see in the car in front. Hopefully they go out of the way uh, really, really quickly here. How do you get DRS? You get it by being... Uh, behind of the car in front within one second within one second of the car in front right then you get the drs so yeah that's gonna be crucial and uh, right now we've been we've been within the D uh, drs the entire way throughout you see on the top left 0 0.3 so if we uh, exceed the one second mark then we gotta start uh, asking to ourselves what the flip are we doing here then because we need to stay within that drs and then the rear flap like you can see right now is opening uh, Jacob J, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family. Are you excited for F122? I am definitely excited. Remember, guys, F1, the F1 game is like my livelihood, you know? So, <laughs> I'm very excited. It's gonna be awesome. Uh, Agus, thank you so much for the follow, too. What's up? Does Verstappen have DRS? Come on, please tell me no. No, he does have DRS. So this lap is uh, one that we have to throw away and we have to use a little bit of extra ERS here to overtake. No, 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 Ricardo. No, 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 don't do this to me. No, don't do this to me. No, Ricardo, don't do this to me. Why are you not going out of the way? We're now 0 0.7 behind over Stepan. Guys, they have something for me. They I have a target on my back. I literally have a target on my back. The competition is rigged. They're all paid actors, man. They're literally all paid actors. 0 0.6 to Verstappen now. And we have to use so much of our ERS. So much of the ERS. Oh, watch out. 0 0.7 now. Yeah, this is going to get tough here. Will we be able to keep the DRS for now? That's going to get interesting. Just about six tenths. Ah, it's okay. We still have good pace, guys. I'm not gonna lie. We're extracting the maximum, though. I'm literally on the limit. Verstappen gets the fastest lap because of that ERS right there. And now we're low on ERS again, man. Uh, we had to use all of the ERS that we had. Otherwise, we couldn't flip and overtake uh, uh, Ricardo there. And stay close enough to uh, Mr. Verstappen. Right. Let's set ourselves up here. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, back on track, Clarky as well as Jacob, Jacob, Pedro. Thank you for the follows. Welcome to the family. Oh, this is gonna get tough, guys. Now, I do believe this was the only option we had. If we went onto the soft tires, we were already too late. When we, when we started thinking about the soft tires, we were already too late. So... Yeah, I do feel like this, is the, this was the only option for us, really. Oh, we're starting to get very squiggly with the rear end. Only 20% of ERS now. And we don't really have what we had before. To be able to attack Verstappen. Oh no, watch out. 0 0.8. <gasps> oh, we need to use so much... And there's a poll up in the chat in the meantime. Make sure you get voting to the poll. That was Norris, not Ricardo. Oh, really? Oh. I did not see that. <laughs> I'm too focused on Verstappen, man. I don't even see the other driver anymore. All right, we're close enough again. That's good. Whoever it was, don't go direct. <laughs> True that. True that. All right, we go. 
If you haven't yet joined the Discord, by the way, guys, join the community on the Discord. I actually announce whenever I go live over there, so you never miss any of the future shows. Uh, now, I will be going to Miami to uh, represent Twitch Sports during the Miami Grand Prix, so there will be some really cool IRL content on here of me in Miami, so make sure you get followed and join the Discord because I'll announce over there whenever I'm going to stream exactly. You do not want to miss that one, I'm telling you right now. Um... And in the Discord, I also have a link in the announcement section to download the 2022 uh, liveries that we're using right now. You're thinking, what the hell? How do you have these liveries? Now, you can join the Discord and in the announcement section, you can download them too. Or free, uh, if you want to. Now, let's go and close in to Verstappen. Six tenths of a second, seven tenths. And uh, we have a little bit of extra ERS, which is really, really good. We're starting to, to like, save up and, and finally get a little bit of a, of a margin here with the ERS as well, so that we can use it later on. Rosario, as well as Ensenair, and Linus. Thank you so much for the follows. All right. Uh, we, by, by, we basically need to do it on this straight because we have a very good first couple of turns. And then we can... Uh, yeah, then we can try and go for more. We just need to now not lose flipping... Uh, oh, I can, I can already see. Guys, Latifi is our nemesis. He is our nemesis on the track. He always gets in our way. Now, right now, number one in the chat if you think Latifi is going to be in our way. Number two in the chat if you think, no, he's going to be uh, very nice to you. What do you think? Literally, I think he's going to be in our way in the worst possible position. And that's literally... Oh my god. No, please no. Yes! He's nice to us. Latifi's nice to us. W! Latifi does not get in the way this time around. Literally, it was the worst possible moment actually right there. And we saw a couple of other drivers actually get in the way. This time around though, Latifi says, Tom, I like you. Oh, I like you too. And now we kiss. Wait, what? All right, come on. Let's close in to uh, Verstappen. 0 0.6, 0 0.5. All right, I reckon maybe we're going to have an opportunity here. I reckon maybe we're gonna have an opportunity here in this lap, in the third here as we close in on Verstappen. No, not really. Not yet, at least. No, 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 no. We're gonna stay behind. Not, it's not important yet. We need to do it in the, in the last and final couple laps. Fast is in the first sector. And Verstappen is struggling. It's all going down here in the last couple of laps. If you're just joining in, a warm, warm welcome to lap 76 out of 71 as we are battling with Verstappen and the closest driver in contention is Sainz in P3, 22 seconds behind. Watch out, that's a little bit of a gut. We will see it through the fingers. 76. Exactly. Come on. All right, we're close enough. For now, at least. We need to be even closer. Another race update in the chat, by the way, for anybody who has missed the majority of the race uh, in the chat, you can uh, catch up with everything that's happened so far. So if you want to know what happened so far in this race, check it out in the chat. Uh, PP has a very detailed uh, race uh, update here. Awesome. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Not close enough. Literally, guys, it's all gonna come down to whether we can stay close enough in the last and final lap. He's so quick in the second sector, you're right. But we can also do something here. And I can do some crazy audacious moves. We will go for P1. We will have one move, okay? Whether, whether it's gonna be clean or not, I will stay true to my name. Tom the Bomb. It will happen. We will go for a move. It will happen. All right. 58%. We are saving the battery. So we need to we need to basically just choose one lap where we get, where we where we where we do it all. Where we where we dump it all. And I think that should be the last and final lap. Come on. Not this lap though. Close in, close in, close in, close in, close in, come on. 63%. I need like 100% so I can dump it in, all, in one corner, in one straight. As we go, at the 100 meter board, in the third gear, over the curbs. Still very close to Verstappen. Well, not close enough. Okay, if we overtake this driver, then we will have... Um, 
like the the blue flag right then we'll have clean air for the last and final uh two laps it's lap 69 out of 71 right now what? noise mazapan please get in the way of verstappen no he will not oh, don't get in the way of me then okay thank you very much and now we're closing into verstappen perhaps this is the moment we haven't been this close yet to verstappen but there will be some dirty air now kicking in as well all right you know what guys i think we might be able to just go for it right here maybe it's too early i don't know but look at how close we are come on do it do it do it 0 0.5 do we do it all right, we're gonna go for it. Ladies and gentlemen, we will dump the battery right here, right now to go for the move on Max Verstappen. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We are gonna go to the left-hand side, break deep into the first turn, one hundred meter board, and Verstappen is gonna hit the inside. We actually go and touch wheels a little bit, but we go for P1 just about now then. With the DRS right now as well, can we drive away now? No, because Verstappen has really, really good pace still. And now it's gonna go down to the last and final lap. We have it within our hands right now. We have it within our hands. Hello, dude. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the family. We have plenty of ERS uh, remaining then to go and defend from Verstappen too. Okay. I'm not going to say what I'm going to do because Verstappen is watching the stream. But I will do something. And you're going to see it in a little bit. Here we go. As Verstappen closes in, he's not close enough. He's not close enough. All right, let's go for this move then. It is going to be the start of the last and final lap. Verstappen is going to take P1. But we will now go for the last and final move. This is your final lap. Final lap of the race. Wait, what? It's too far. It's too far. It's too far. No. Oh my God. Oh my God. We can't do it. Okay, it's not over yet. It's not over yet. No. Oh my God, I can't believe it. One last sector. I want to have to dive it somewhere. But the car is struggling hard. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. As we go through the last couple of turns, we had the lead for just a small moment as we try and do our very best with the fireworks coming out on track right now as well. We will lose to Verstappen and Verstappen will most likely be crowned the champion. It won't be us. We gave him the position, but we could not make it happen again. We finished P to uh, well either we one. kept the position there we went through the last corner we would have lost the position too or we did that but we didn't get the traction we, we had to get and we will not win the race and so the celebration verstappen wins the champion clap it up in the chat he has been dominant we gotta give it to him verstappen wins this was our last and final uh, thing we could do to, to defend the championship here, but Verstappen wins the championship and we could not uh, get anywhere close because there's two races to go still and already uh, it's, been, it's just been too dominant. His car was amazing. Uh, he, his car is like half a tenth quicker than us per lap. And you saw that in the race as well. We just could not stay close. Normally we tried to extract the maximum out of the car. We did. We did. We could have won, but at the same time, it was impossible because and i know we do the impossible and we almost did but uh, he was just too quick he was just too quick clap it up in the chat though for yourselves clap with a capital c what an amazing race that was awesome though right we're not done yet though so make sure you stick around and if you enjoyed that make sure you hit the follow button uh, this was the last stream of the week because i'm gonna go to portugal tomorrow and then i'm back then i'm doing one stream then i'm doing one stream on the wednesday next week and then i'm going to miami whoa what the hell yeah very busy <laughs> 
very busy. It's gonna be awesome. Uh, Danny, thank you for the follow as well as Gijs, as well as Lev Goetze, and uh, Steven, as well as Hello Do Footballer, and Rosario. Thank you so much for the follows, guys. Welcome to the family. That was intense, huh? But unluckily, we did not get Let's the win in the end. The but uh, we tried our best Anthony in the end. Davidson. Who do you pick? I it's feel like we did a uh, pretty good job, huh? Smooth, confident, and assured. But uh, no it wasn't enough. It was not enough. Verstappen wins the, the championship. Now, what we're going to do, we're going to go back to the team headquarters. We're going to finish it off in style. So make sure you stick around. Um, and I'll end the prediction for you guys right here as well. Because, uh, of course, PP had to vote as well, huh? <laughs> All good, man. There you go. Yeah, you can vote too. Will we win the Grand Prix? No, it's a scam. Honestly, guys. That was our win, man. We fought so hard for it. With a car that was not as quick as the Red Bull. Um, but yeah, it was just we just had, didn't have enough of the car. Because we, we had to be on the limit every single lap. And it was a very smart thing to do, leaving him by. But then I, was, I just left him a little bit too much space. We had to go into the throttle a little bit earlier. If we did so, I would have been able to get that P1. But man, oh man, we misjudged it just by a little margin, like half a tenth of a second. And uh, that's what's gonna make you lose the race right here. Uh, 21 Eddie, this was uh, Jacob Helmer, this was Koshi FN. Thank you for the follows. Welcome to the family. Sao Paulo is the next one. Uh, we have two races remaining. Uh, as you can see right here, Brazil and Saudi Arabia. And as you can see right now, we are in P4, 94, 98 points. We can still get P2 in the championship. So I think that's what we should go for. We have 15 points to P2. That's Carlos Sainz, who had an atrocious race. Uh, don't uh, ask me why. Um, okay. As we now go to. Um, Saudi Arabia, no, uh, Brazil, and then Saudi Arabia to finish off the season. So, what do you guys think? Should we do Sao Paulo today? Yes or no? You want me to do the race now? What do we think? Yes or no? Should we do it now? Sao Paulo now? Yes? Yes, no, yes, no, yes, yes, no, yes.